crowd. No, 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 no. The, the truth is, come on. Some of you guys, you don't know what happened. Pastor Kelly, we had a prayer meeting here on Friday with the Bible body. And the word God gave me very clear. With joy, you shall draw for the wells of salvation. And come on, from, we were calling wells on Friday. We were asking God to make us wells. Seriously. Do I have any agreement here for those of you that are here? We were asking God. God said, I have made you wells for many to come. Oh, you know, and, and the word God gave me was that word is the Rehoboth. And I was teaching the people of God that Isaac made it because he found wells. So, what else? God again has confirmed. So thank you. That word is from the is from the throne room of God. And so let it be. We're gonna sing. We're gonna sing to the Lord. I'm gonna. What was that we singing? Okay. Your hand lifted up. We're gonna just worship the Lord. And then I'm gonna ask Pastor Kevin to come. I just as she dedicates myself. It's hold on, guys. You see, I could have done it differently. Tony asked me. We could have, you know, write everybody, make sure you're here, everybody, invite family, invite friends. But I just totally, I don't, I don't feel that way. You understand? I didn't feel. People were even surprised that I celebrated because it wasn't announced. Amen. Nothing was announced about anything about birthday. Somebody asked me, wow, we're celebrating 25 years. Can we come and celebrate? But it's not about that. You know what God said to me? It's about what next. And that's what she said. It's not really about looking. Look, what I'm looking for, you know, as long as people are alive and as long as people, God has called them to London and as long as God has called them to this place, let's dedicate, you know, when we say this, I'm not asking you to dedicate your 25 lives, 25 years to me. I'm not saying that. If you are here for one day, make an impact. Amen. If you are here for two weeks, make an impact. Amen. What I'm saying. But I really felt God was saying, dedicate your next years. <laughs> Because the next few years are going to be much, much more. Anyway, it's what she said. So that's what I thought. We could have done it in a different way. I'm not celebrating. I'm bringing everybody to come and eat my rice and then they go back like a pub and they don't do anything for God. But whoever's around today that have heard this message, let it count for the eternity and for the salvation of many. So let's sing to the Lord and then we're going to come and we're going to pray. Let's sing to the Lord. Thank you.
cakes. There's um there's one for the evening. We're gonna be celebrating but today is birthday, but I'm gonna ask Pastor Kevin to do both to pray for my birthday. To you know, I'm dedicating my life. I'm 52. I want to be strong at 52, you know, 53, 54, and also 25 years of serving the Lord. So she's gonna be praying, you know, at both, 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 both. You know, make sure you come out tonight. There's gonna be a big celebration here. All right, and um, Michelle's gonna be around as well, ministering to the Lord. Okay, over to you. Thank you. Amen. You know, uh, as I was preparing this morning, um, I really felt the Lord impress upon me that uh, that I should proclaim the blessings of the Jubilee Amen. upon Pastor Chai, upon Tony, and upon the house. Amen. And, and if, is anybody here over 50 that would admit they are over 50? Yes. <laughs> because I believe that the, the, the blessing of the, of, of the Jubilee is for you as well. Amen. And, and I'm going to be proclaiming it because. Although this is not the year itself, but I have not had the opportunity to pray specifically with you since you turned the January, which is taking place and all that, but not. And I really feel that God, God is wanting me to share uh, with you the, um, <coughs> the, the blessings of the year of Jubilee. And... Um, the, the year of Jubilee is a year of rejoicing, a, a, a year where you come into the fullness of your of everything that belongs to you. And I'm declaring by the Spirit of the Living God today that you are entering in into the full possession of that which God has deeded and planned for you in the name of Jesus. And I, I, I declare because it is Jubilee, every impediment and obstacle is removed out of your way in the name of Jesus. And I decree and declare that in the year of, because it's the year of Jubilee, everything that is owed to you, everything that is yours, that had your name on it, every, every destiny, every, every plan, every entrance, and every, every ministry, every well-being that God for you. every gift and, and every every possession that was that that was, had always been yours, but which is hidden somewhere else, or if somebody else is holding it, I declare it to me. And I declare that they will return in the name of Jesus. Wherever they may be hiding, I proclaim to be upon those things, and I cause a return in the name of Jesus. into that um, a, a, a trap will by willingly and blindly and stupidly because it is jubilee. Bible says, 
I speak to you, young man, because you are strong. I declare the strength of God upon all of you, 30 to 40 something, in this house. You will carry the burden of this house with joy, with strength, and with power. In the name of Jesus, receive the anointing that goes with the assignment. In the name of Jesus. And I pray for the youngsters, those that are. 10 to 20 something, I ask, oh God, that your power may rest upon me. This generation that will turn the world upside down, I ask, oh God, that they will be not compromising in the name of Jesus, that they will turn their, their friends unto the love of Jesus Christ, that you open their eyes, you speak to them in their closet, that it may be well with them in the name of Jesus. For the children, oh God, up to 10 years old, Father, let your grace rest upon them. From a tender age, let them be like Samuel, that you speak to them, even in their dreams, that they will be able to identify the word of the Lord, and that your name may be glorified. Thank you, oh God. Thank you for this ministry. Thank you, Lord God, that has allowed my brother and my sister to see these 25 years, and you have kept them, and you have greeted them. Thank you, O Lord, because the best is yet to come. Thank you that you open me the nations before them. Thank you because you have given them peace of mind concerning the work in the house, because you have raised up able, able sons to carry, to carry the torch forward. I bless you in the name of Jesus. Amen. And amen. Hallelujah.